So Betty has another question. Okay. How do you get the grackles to go away? Bad news, Betty. <laughs> <laughs> They're not bad, gonna go away? Bad news, no, it's, that's tough. Uh, I, I wish there was a good way, and there's really not. If you're in an area where they congregate, uh, right now, this time of year, there shouldn't be too many of them. There may be some young ones out of the nest now, so you might be seeing two or three or four. They're just birds, feed them. But as we get closer to fall and the, the hordes start gathering, they can come into your yard and think this is wonderful and just stay there and start eating the food and they'll dominate for a while. Uh, I have done a couple of things in the past. One, I take two pieces of wood and slap them together. I call it a clapper. Yeah. And it makes a loud retort like a gun or something going off and they will scatter. You do that three or four times, it, it really slows them down. It doesn't seem to bother the other birds that much, but just a, a loud retort type noise yeah. will, will scare them off immediately. In fact, the, the one I made, I just put a hinge right at the bottom of it, a piano hinge, and it's two long pieces of wood, about that long flat, so they'll hit together. You can buy pieces of wood like that. Uh, a one by three or one by four is, is good. And you just take them and just, I put two handles on it, just pull it together like that and make it pop. You gotta bring that in sometime. I'll bring it in next That's time. Brilliant. And talk about it, a grackle clapper. <laughs> and uh, I just keep it on the back porch so, and they'll be using it probably in another two or three weeks as they start gathering up. So when there's too many of them up there, I just pop it a few times and are scare they, them off. Are they maybe one of the birds that does not like um, safflower? They are. It hasn't been that long since we've been together, has it? You remember all this good stuff. <laughs> well, because the crows won't eat us yeah. out in, out of house and home, but we can get the yeah. cardinals because nobody else yeah. seems to love the safflower. Safflower. Safflower seed is a wonderful thing. We've been using, I've been using it for 30 years now. Uh, when the grackles get really bad, I'll have a feeder or two of my feeder collection just stocked with safflower seed, nothing yeah. else. Yeah. And they'll come up, they'll throw some of it out on the ground, but then they realize there's nothing in there they want to eat. Uh, blackbirds. Uh, the brewer's blackbirds, the other blackbirds, the, the grackles, and even crows don't s tend to like safflower seed. Yeah. Not sunflower, but safflower. So to make safflower oil out of. And uh, so, yeah, find some safflower seed, put that in your feeder. It'll slow down your bird feeding. It'll also really slow down the grackles. Yeah, it yeah. will. But you'll see a lot of beautiful cardinals, and yes. cardinals are so much Fun yeah, and there's a lot see. of other the songbirds will eat it, but uh, uh, chickadee might not eat it, and some of the really small ones. But the other birds will, will still come to your feeder, and the grackles will give it up. Hello, this is Richard Cole. I want to thank each of you for watching, and I want you to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and don't forget to share it.